I've had this piece of 10mm thick stainless steel stood up against this wall for about 10 years or more um, and I finally got a use for some of it it's going to be bugger to cut these shapes cut out with a water jet um, we don't have a water jet, it was cut by someone else and this was the off cut and it was just given to us to uh, keep in case they wanted something else cut and as I say it's been here for 10 years so I'm going to start cutting this up into uh, kind of small manageable pieces and then we'll lay out a template on top of the thing that we've got to make now Well, I was just going to try and put this, lay this down onto a table so I can start cutting it, but the darn thing is flipping heavy. Um, so, I'm going to start cutting it up with it lent against the wall, cut the bits off that I don't particularly need at the minute, and hopefully the bottom bit will be a bit more manageable. Well, well, there's some a bit of tension in this. That was straight until I started trying to cut through it. And obviously where this is bending, it's, it's trying to pinch the cutting disc. So I'm going to leave that. Oh dear, try and cut through somewhere else. Um, and it's going to fall off, isn't it, as soon as I get through. Oh, I'm going to have to try and cut through here. And the top is going to fall over, isn't it? Ho hum. Well, I managed to take cut the top part of this plate off without it falling on me, and there's an astonishing amount of distortion in this plate. I've seen it before in things like 3 or 4 millimeter aluminium where I've cut shapes out and they, they bend up or what's left of the plate bends the other way. But this thing, wow, you see that? Now this edge here And that is a mile away from lining up with this. Look at the curve in that piece. And this one, this side, curves the other way. Don't know if we can see that. I'll stick it on the table. I'm sure that'll show it up. And the piece I cut off. Kind of similar. <laughs> That's 
crazy. And it's a while since um, we had these pieces cut out originally out of this plate. And I'm, I'm thinking that they must have been bent as well. Um, kind of forgotten, but I've, I've got sneaky suspicion I might have had to try and flatten them out. Let's get this thing on the, t on the bench and see what it looks like up there. So that's the top bit. See this gap here? Yeah, like I'm going to bend that and spring it. But look at that bit there. Here's the other bit. That is just amazing. And I want to cut something out of this piece. But look at the bow on it. Actually, I don't know. Maybe it'll be okay. Or maybe, by the time I've cut the piece out, it'll, it'll bend even more. Oof. Well. Wow.